What do you think this 2023 class can do together in Austin? Man, we're going to do something special. We definitely going to go get a natty for sure before we graduate. So, hey, I'm telling y'all now, we're going to get a natty. So stay tuned, 2023. Talk about your experience down here in San Antonio with all these guys. Experience was out of this world. It was great. I mean, it, it just had a lot of energy, a lot of people to come out to the stadium, just support. You know, it felt great just to play a lot. I mean, even though we didn't win, it just felt great just to play in front of 23,000 people. So, you know, everything was just out of this world. For sure. You got open all week, mm -hmm. turn off that speed and everything. What do you think you can bring to that Texas offense? The exact same thing. Speed, my, my route running, my agility. I feel like... Nobody speak compares to mine, so that's what I can bring to it. Is that the best attribute of your game? That is my the best attribute. What, what got you to Texas? For people that don't know, what got you in, in the bow and in the Walmart signing class? Their culture, the energy, the everything about them, the coaching, the players. You know the, how the co how the coaches co uh, yeah. can like relate to their players a lot, and they real fun, energetic. They know how to relate to them, so that's what really led me the culture. What's your relationship with quarterback Arch Manning? It's great. We text a lot. We we actually check up from time to time, see what we're doing better to get uh, for the uh, next level. So it's real great. What's the thing you're most looking forward to once you finally get to Austin, once you're finally a student and you're finally living on the 40 acres? Just winning. Yeah. When I get there, I just want to win. When you ask Jelani McDonald what, what this class can do, mm -hmm. he thinks y'all can win the Natty. What kind of, of goals do y'all have? have in I mind? feel like we can do anything if we put our minds to it. I feel like we can go as far as we want. We just got to play hard. All right, Samaji, so you just played the All-American Bowl. What was the experience this week like? I know you got here late. What was it like? I um, mean, it was really like having to lock in and like catch back up with the group, learn the defense, and really still just have fun. PK! <laughs> you got you got Payne Kirkland here. Yeah. Y'all two on the East team. What kind of bragging oh, rights? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> what bragging rights y'all have in the West? I mean, you know, I knew what it was since they want to practice. You know, I try. I've been warning them all week. I told them I'm a Take him, choke slam him. I told him I'm a, I told him I'm a choke slam him. I told him we're gonna win by a lot. I told him what I told him what was gonna happen. And they didn't believe in us, you know what I'm saying? And we love it when they don't believe in us. So, you know, I love when they count us. We picked we picked up the greatest addition at linebacker in the nation. We don't mess with those people, those are those are soldiers. So, you know, we picked up a great addition at linebacker and you know, yeah. So on to the next chapter, you know, tomorrow's day one of hell for me. So you looking forward to it. What are you looking forward to most at time? Working for Kyle Flood. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mic drop right there. Um, yeah, you're about to be at Texas as well and everything. Um, what, I was talking to Ryan, talking to Jelani. What, what do you think this class together can do? Man, I think that we could really for sure win the Natty. We all believe in it, and I think that's what it takes. It takes, like, a building block of a class that all believes in it. And every signing that we have, that's the goal. We all don't want less than what we know we can achieve. For sure. And last question, I guess. So what what are you most looking forward to? What are you most excited about once you are finally a Longhorn? Man, really just stepping on that field. Like, it's different being like a recruit and stepping on uh, DKR. But like being in the uniform and knowing I'm official, it's, it's going to hit different. What, what message do you have to, to Texas Longhorn Nation, to their fans? What, what message do you have for them? We coming. We not done. Look them.
right, Jelani. Uh, how does it feel to cap off this week? You know, with a commitment, you finally got the decision out the way. Um, how does it feel? Man, it feels great, you know. No pressure on my back no more. All I got to do is work now, so it's all in front of me now. For sure. Um, what all went into that decision to choose Texas? You have some two other big skin contenders in your recruitment. Why Texas? Man, like I said, I just felt more, more, the most comfortable at Texas. You know, I'm still, in, I'm still in Texas, not too far from home, so it's like I just felt most comfortable. What was their pitch to get you in this class? I know they targeted you down the stretch in the fall. What was the message to get you finally in that class on both? Man, we could shoot, we could use you. You will be you will be a big part of our team. Yeah. And so I already know some of the other commits, so it's like we already gonna have a smart like a somewhat of a chemistry. So that's how it's just going. Where do you think you fit in that defense? You know they got Anthony Hill, a linebacker, they got Connor, they got some other dudes on that defense. Where do you fit in, in that defense? Uh, I fit around that nickel position. Nickel. That's that's why I'm, I, I feel like that's why I'm gonna eat at the most. I know you balled out a corner. You're manning up against some of the best corners in the country. What do you think you proved it to yourself and kind of showed everybody else? That I can stick with anybody and that I'm a true athlete. True athlete. And last question I have: What do you think this 2023 class can do together in Austin? Man, we're gonna do something special. We definitely gonna go get a natty for sure before we graduate. So hey, I'm telling y'all now, we gonna get a natty. So stay tuned. 2023. All right, Anthony, you just finished the week in San Antonio and, you know, with all your guys, all the Texas commits, everybody, all your friends. What was it like? What was your favorite part of the week? Just being able to compete with all these different guys. Like, you see all over Twitter and just all over. Just being able to pick some of them and just and just show that, show your skills. For sure. You played with a couple of Texas commits on that yeah. West team. Um, what was the bond like between all of you guys? I, I knew a lot of them close, so just being able to have a better bond with them was real cool. Why, before we go off to college, I leave. I leave tomorrow, go straight up to Austin. What are you looking forward to most once to get in Austin? You know, Peyton Kirkland mentioned yeah. that it's going to be kind of hell the first couple of days. Yeah. But he's looking forward to it. What are you looking forward to? What are you most excited about? Just going to compete. Just going to compete. A new level of competition. Just going to do that. For sure. Yes, I know uh, Samaj, Samaji, he mentioned you guys yeah. have a really good friendship at linebacker. Yeah. He kind of, he said he kind of knew you went up at the, in the Texas class. What yeah. was it about these guys, you know, Jonte Cook recruiting you to finally get you in that boat? Well, John Tate been my guy since like sixth grade. We, that's been my friend since sixth grade. So I've been knowing him for a little while. I just made it an easy transition for me. For sure. What do you think this class together can do on the 40 acres? We just got to go out there and prove it. I don't even want to talk about it. Let's go prove it out there on the field. For sure. And last question, what do you have? What message do you have to Longhorn fans? Hey, let's go to work, man. I'm here. I'm here tomorrow, actually. Let's go to work. Hey, y'all know that Longhorns, Texas, we in it for the we in it for the, we in it for the win. Let's go. He There's no better place to follow the future than on OrangeBloods.com and the OrangeBloods Texas Football Channel on YouTube.